Hey, what is up guys, TV here, and welcome back to my channel. For those who are new here, please don't forget to click that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you will get notified with my new videos on this channel. Now, for this video guys, I will show you how to install GMS to your Huawei devices in just a few minutes. If you're interested, let's go ahead and start. <music> Alright, we are back. Okay, so first things first guys, make sure that we have all the things that we need. So in our PC, you just need to uh, download the Multi-Tool 8 from the MT Teams website. And just, you know, have it ready here. And then on our device, we just need to go and download the file that I have ready for you called the Huawei Native GMS uh, zip and extract it so you will get all the files that's in here and by the way guys these are the files that we'll be needing um, for this process okay so also make sure to download F-Droid and then from F-Droid you can install our Aurora store so you will get the latest one okay and once everything is set up um, make sure to install the very first file here on our device this one here and log into all of your accounts so I have that already installed and um, I have the account already here as well in the system and uh, make sure that you have this one here checked as well okay so once everything or all your accounts are already added and don't worry because if you don't have or if you don't want to add the other accounts right now, it's going to be just really easy to um, add accounts on here. So that's not really a problem though. But make sure that, you know, if you don't want or you have ev everything ready, okay? If you want to have this completed as soon as possible. Okay, so after that, just install uh, the number one file up to number four. So let's do that right now. Second. Third. It's not installing Google Services Framework and it's taking some time to do it. Okay, now the fourth file here, the last file we need from that folder. So let's wait for that. And usually the uh, services also takes much longer than, than the other ones here so okay so the, all the four files have already been installed now go back to users and accounts under settings to uh, make sure these are all synced okay so once everything everything is synced here you just need to uh, go and uh, uh, connect the phone to our PC And of course, make sure that uh, USB debugging is turned on. Just set that to file. So HDB as well from here is turned on. Just to make sure that we won't miss any uh, connection here. Okay, like that. And let me just close this one really quick. And you should see that the device is connected under here. And just click on this button here. It may say, uh, say fill or update okay and then under this folder or tab rather um, click on show system and click show button so don't do anything else other than the ones that I'm showing you right here and uh, search for Google dot Android GSF okay so just disable this one say okay and we're done so that's all we need from this uh, thing here so we can close that now and let me maximize this all right so here now we have to focus on our phones uh things that we need to do so at this point um we need to go to aurora store okay 
and search for play services info All right, installing it now. All right. Just waiting for that to get installed. All right, it's now installed. So we don't, uh, I mean, we don't need the Play Store anymore though. So you can just hide that anywhere you want for now. And then here, so what we can do next is to go back to settings, go to apps, apps, search for Google, and then uninstall services. Then now go back to the app we just installed to click on Play Store and choose Aurora Store to open that and install this one here to get the latest one. Install it and wait for it to show a message that it's already installed. So, again, for the services, it really takes time usually to do it and let's just wait for it there we go as soon as you see that it's now giving you a open option here that means that it's already installed okay so basically guys you're done so you can then just install the apps that, that you need so here I'm gonna install Gmail And I'm going to go with YouTube. And Studio. Just the, uh, the few things that I need for now. All right, and now it's installing. Okay, for Gmail, there you go. It's working right away. That's good. For YouTube, that's also working now. That's great. And for Studio. All right, guys. So basically, that's it. You're done. So just you just use um, Aurora Store uh, as a re replacement for Play Store in this case so you won't have to deal with any um, errors popping up for you know um, using the Play Store but um, all the apps that you can download from Play Store um, using Aurora Store will definitely work on here so yeah uh, thank you very much for watching this video and as always you are the best so yeah see you in the next one Peace. Hello my friends, Lorenz Dykes TV here and if you like my video, please smash that like button, share the video, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for your help. Here's how you do it. Boom. Bada bim bada boom. And if you are on your phone, here's how you do it. Boom. Bada bim bada boom. Thank you and see ya in my next videos. Peace.